it's vital for us to understand that if we were to say tawassul is a means for reaching Allah in this world, and shafa'a will define as um, the intercession of a particular individual in the hereafter. Let's define it for this, for the um, audience tonight. Both the word wasila and the word shafa'a are used in the Quran. So for example, the word wasila is used in Surah 5, verse 35 in the Quran. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Ya ayyuhal ladhina aminu, attaqu Allah wa bitaqu ilayhi al-wasila. O oh, you who believe, be conscious of Allah and seek a means to reach Him. Seek a means to reach Him offers a quite beautiful option to the human being. That you as a human being can come to me directly. In your salah, you come to me directly. You tell me, إِيَّاكَ نَعْبُدُ وَإِيَّاكَ نَسْتَعِينَ اَهْدِنَ الصَّرَاطَ الْمُسْتَقِيمِ But likewise, in your same salah, I've also told you, to, for you to every day remember that you should be on the path of those I have given my ni'am. My blessings. Mm -hmm. look, notice in the salah. المستقيم, direct to Allah. عليهم, ya Allah, I want to reach your path. The path of those you put your ni'ma on. That means there are a group of creations of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who Allah has blessed. Who he has sent as role models to mankind. As scholars for mankind. Even as martyrs in his way. Allah used them to reach us. We use them to reach Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Isn't that true? Yeah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala uses wasila to reach me as a human being. He uses a creation of his to reach me. So why can't I as a human being use that creation to reach Allah? However, at the same time I can say, Ya Allah, I'm using you alone. That's it. I don't want to use any creation. When I say, for example, in a dua, Allahumma inni as'aluka wa atawajjahu ilayka bi nabiyyik. Ya Allah, I ask you, but the way I ask you is through your Prophet because he is beloved to you. It's like now I go for, to apply for a job. When I go to apply for this job, I could easily go direct to the manager. I've got a friend of mine who's close to the manager. I can go direct to the manager with my CV. All what I can do is go to my friend and say, listen, do you mind passing the CV? to the manager. The manager is the ultimate decision maker. But I know my friend has a lofty position with the manager. That's in terms of wasila. So who's the helper? Is it the means or is it the ends? The helper is the ends. That's Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But the means is, Ya Allah, I want to ask through them because you told me that these people are so beloved to you. In terms of shafa'ah, let's say the intercession of the hereafter. In terms of the intercession of the hereafter, what do we find? We find in the Quran, sometimes there are verses which say there will be no shafa'a on the day of judgment. There will be no intercession. So someone comes forward and says, how comes you believe in shafa'a? The verses in the Quran say there will be no shafa'a. We reply, bring the verses also which say there will be shafa'a. And that, then we have to put everything in context. The verses in the Quran which say there will be no shafa'a refer to those who looked for the intercession of the idols on the day of judgment. And can an idol intercede for you in this world, let alone in the hereafter? No. Mm. Therefore, the Quran said that the shafa'ah of such people is not going to help you. The shafa'ah of the idols will not help you. However, there are other verses in the Quran where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, for example, may come forward and state that, um, let's say, Surah 20, verse 109. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that shafa'ah can only be given to the one who Allah has pleased with him and has placed mercy upon him. Okay? Someone who Allah is pleased with him, and is pleased with his words, and has placed mercy upon him. There are many hadiths in both schools of Islam. A martyr will be able to perform shafa on the day of judgment. A scholar will be able to intercede for you on the day of judgment. An alim will be able to intercede for you on the day of judgment. In other words, there is a belief that there is this shafa which will happen, but only by the permission of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If permission is not given, then it will not happen. And don't just think that because you love a member of Ahlul Bayt, it means that they will intercede for you on the Day of Judgment. Imam Salih says, those who neglect Salah, for example, our Shafa'ah will not prevail for them. Mm. So we look at this and then someone asks the question, that okay, we accept that on the Day of Judgment there will be intercession. A martyr, an alim, a scholar, a Quran memorizer, um, um, a prophet of God, they can intercede. But they're dead now, so why do you ask through them now? We reply by saying, number one, a person who dies in the way of Allah is not dead. Rather, he is living according to the Quran. 
Number two, if these people are dead, like Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa people say, don't ask through Rasulullah, ask Allah direct. We reply, then don't say your salams to Rasulullah and salah. If Rasulullah is dead, salah is wajib on him, he's going to reply back to you. So don't send your salams to Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alihi and your salah. We are of the belief that even Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alihi after he passed away, there were companions who'd come near his grave saying, Ya Rasulullah, when you were alive, the verse said, وَلَوْ أَنَّهُمْ اِبْضَلَمُوا أَنفُسَهُمْ جَاءُوكَ وَاسْتَغْفِرُ اللَّهُ وَاسْتَغْفِرَ لَهُمْ الرَّسُولُ لَوَجَدُ اللَّهُ تَوَابًا رَحِيمًا There was a verse in the Qur'an which said that had they, when they were unjust to themselves, had they come to you and asked for forgiveness, we would have forgiven them. They said, Ya Rasulullah, you were alive, this happened. Now that you are dead, we have come to you again. And mm -hmm. that they heard a reply. They heard a reply from Rasulullah. Because Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa died in the way of Allah. Mm -hmm. But the helper ultimately is Allah and the permission is with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and that always has to be remembered.